What's up, everybody? I'm Evil Rabbit. We're here on a set of Corsa looking at a modified IRT Supra that my buddy Christmas is going to be rocking with uh, some purple neons in the front and is that Evil Rabbit Motorsports glowing on the window banner. Today, we're going to get those Supra tandems that I told you guys about because he's going to be rocking the old and I'm going to be rocking the new, the new A90 Supra I've been working on, which also has, you know, a few little lighting characteristics like you know the glowing Toyota logo the glowing banner the glowing Supra on the back so the A90 Supra is something I've been working on because there's something else that I'm gonna be working on that you guys are gonna be very excited about we're gonna talk a little bit more about that in the video but Nate and I are gonna go get some tandems old versus new so make sure you guys follow me on Instagram and Twitter all of which are found in the description box below and as always let's get to it <laughs> So, like I said, old. <laughs> we are in old versus new here today. Gonna do some tandems here on Bushido Series Rockingham, one of my favorite tracks to run right now. So the reason I've been building a lot of cars recently, all very similar power and everything, is that is because I am going to be doing a Drift Invitational. I think we're going to start with a Grade 8 Drift Invitational, and then maybe go on further, but we're going to be using my cars that are all similar power, all similar everything, and we're going to be doing tandems here at Rockingham. So I will be sending out some invitations to some people that are going to compete in the first Drift Invitational, but oh, I stalled the car. Nate and I are going to get some practice here in these cars to see how they go toe to toe being two different cars similar chassis but different wheelbases and everything like that to see so Nate whenever you're ready let's go let's do it flick in oh, oh I got that <laughs> well <clears throat> nobody saw that right let's go back to start <laughs> and rerun So like I said, I will be doing like I want to do a drift invitational using my cars, which are all the about the same power. It will make the tandems a lot better and make the tandems cooler in my uh, in my mind. And uh, I will be judging it along with some other people, and we'll be doing it live on the channel. So like I said, I'm probably gonna start with a grade eight, and maybe a top sixteen later on. But for the first one, there's gonna be eight people that are invited. I already have three people in mind. Gonna be inviting some other people to, you know get sideways here on the channel with uh, myself and some other people judging in tandems. I see that purple in my mirror right now. That looks sweet. All right, let's try and do this without messing up. Yeah, well, well about that. Did you not have a tune loaded? I had a tune loaded. I just completely messed up. I haven't practiced yet tonight, all right? A little bit this short on my, there. This yeah, is this is your practice. <laughs> I was also modifying my brake pedal right before this, so you know I haven't had a chance to. Well, I'm sticking on your door with this A90. I see that. I kind of faltered off in the last section, though. Ooh, Ooh hello. All right, let's flip it up. I told you guys I was gonna be doing an A90 versus a basically original OG Supra, so that's what we're here. You ready? Yep. Just a banging red line. Oh, am I gonna push wide? Nope, 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 we're good. A little bit shallow on that clip though. The super I think needs a big wing. Big wing club. Oh, just destroying my red line. I don't, know, I don't know if you could actually see, but I was like on you the whole time. Oh, I saw it. I saw it. We also got the uh, cinematic angles going on up in there, so everybody else saw it too. Got the cinematic Dude, overlays. Oh, that was a hard left foot break, so I didn't hit you. 
think that might have been a little bumper butt. Oh my Nate! Going deep in that little hairpin section. Oh, I couldn't, couldn't reach it out there. Solid runs though, so let's flip it up again. So I think Rockingham is going to be the first one for the Drift Invitational because it's a, it's a fun course, it's very flowy, and it's just one of my favorite courses I got to run when I was doing the Bushido series. So, ooh, a little bit off that. Oh, I had a bad initiation there. Oh, that was terrible. Did you hit the wall? Yeah, I initiated a little far outside that white line and went into the wall. And it just messed this whole run up. Yikes. Oh, yeah. You make a bad initiation. No one watched watch this run. No one watched this run. Oh, everybody's watching it. Everybody sees I it from know. bird's eye view, too. I know. This is awful. Is that wall tap, though? I'm not even trying to run line on this one. Wow, that was that was ugly. Ugly in every sense of the word. <laughs> it happens. All right, I'm gonna try to stick to your door on this initiation too. It Let's breaks go. my heart. Oh. You hit by there, or was that that was, was that? Nah, that was. I didn't give you that much room, but I didn't mess you up too bad. Oh my, door taps, door taps. All the door taps. Oh, <laughs> oh my gosh. All the door taps is there, sir. Thank you, thank you. All right. Now let's see if we can get a good chase. Ready? I did not get out fly. So I can go to fourth in this section. And then back to third. This A90 is so good. Both these Supras are amazing. All right, let's get one more chase. All right. You ready? Yep. Oh, save it, save it. There you go. Oh my, I surged way too short on that one. Dude, this A90 is so good. All right, let's uh, change up tracks. Do some uh, hardcore slides. Door sure. to door. All right, let's... let's see if I can do some clean stuff here, because. I wasn't having it at Rocking Amp for some reason. Well, now we're just going to run some straight tandies. Get a little door door action. Angle stall. I saw that. This A90 is so good. New favorite drift car. Oh my goodness. Is that sun bothering you? <laughs> Me? No, not at all. 
Should've went in the fourth through that section. Me or you? Me. Mm. I, I lost a little ground. Wheel scrubs. Just a little. Ooh. Clipping wings on the ends of walls. I'm clipping bumpers on transitions. Thor love. <laughs> the, cars, the cars get lost in the smoke. Oh, there we go. Yes. Oh. A little bump. My front end did not like dipping into the grass there. Oh, I missed a gear. I got off the clutch too soon. <laughs> And it went in neutral. Oh, well that's no good. Definitely doesn't help with the drifting. Oh, angle stall. So what do you think of the new A90? It looks good. Looks a lot better than I expected. Wasn't a huge fan when those things first came out. Yeah, the wide body and everything makes it makes it look a lot nicer. It does. Oh my wall tips! Massive jump drift. Because why not? Nailed it. Oh well. So I think that'll about wrap up this video here for today. Big thank you, Nate, for coming out again, having some fun. A little old versus new super battle. 2J versus B. I forgot what motor comes in the Z4. B58? B50? Well, I think this A90 might be one of the cars that are available for the Drift Invitational. Like I said, going to be sending out some invites to five other competitors for the first one. And if it goes as good as I hope and it works, then I will do some more Drift Invitationals. So I will keep you guys informed. Make sure you guys stay on my Instagram to be informed when it's going to be and everything like that, when it's going to go live because uh, the actual event I will stream live on the channel. So, as always, make sure you follow me on all social media, all of which are found in the description box below. Hard jump. Oh, reverse entry. How did I save that? <laughs> okay. And as always, I like thank you guys for watching. I'm Evil Rabbit, and I'll see you guys on the track.